Hi and welcome to this week's look at headlines in natural health on iHealthTube.com. Well, we all know the importance of vitamin C and some believe in the effectiveness of the vitamin as a cancer therapy. Well, now research out of New York is indicating just how it may be able to help some cancers. In some blood cancers, genetic changes reduce the ability of an enzyme called TET2 to encourage stem cells to become mature blood cells which eventually die. For example, in leukemia, signals that tell a blood cell to mature malfunction. It's then left to endlessly multiply instead of producing normal white blood cells. The study showed that high dose vitamin C may activate this TE2 function that would then encourage these stem cells to mature and eventually die, which is a natural anti-cancer safety mechanism. Well, scientists have long known that stress and heart health are connected. Now there is more evidence as to just how they are connected. Research out of Massachusetts looked closely at the region of the brain associated with fear and stress called the amygdala. The study looked at nearly 300 adults who had PET and CT scans that recorded brain activity, bone marrow activity, spleen activity, and inflammation in the heart arteries. Researchers found a link between higher activity in the amygdala and a higher risk of a cardiovascular event. The findings suggest that stress may activate the amygdala, which leads to extra immune cells produced by bone marrow, which may affect arteries, causing inflammation which would lead to an event like a heart attack or a stroke. In the U.S., more than a third of adults have at least one type of cardiovascular disease, and it's still the leading cause of death in this country. Well, most of us could benefit from eating just a little less. New research, though, out of California is showing that it may help us live longer as well. The study looked at rodents by testing liver samples, and they found in older mice they processed energy inefficiently. But another group of older mice were fed a diet with 30% fewer calories for six months, and the result was not only more efficient energy processing, but also a benefit to the biological clock. Another study found that low-calorie diets contribute to preventing the effects of physiological aging, which could, down the road, have huge impacts on human aging. That's a look at what's making headlines in natural news this week. Stay connected to the latest in natural health by going to iHealthTube.com and signing up for our free email newsletter.